Uh, I'm Paul Jackson and uh, I own, manage and promote um, and fuel the fires of the Adelphi. I like Hull. Uh, I think it has a bit of an advantage being just a semicircle. I, I think rather than being an amorphous blob, it, uh, it, 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 you always have a sense of precisely where you are. Neutral Milk Hotel, Sigur Ross. I, I used to uh, love the late John Peel. Now he's gone. R.I.P. Perhaps somebody like Jarvis Cocker. I really like his, his sort of world view. Um, I think he's developing uh, into a great ambassador for, for music and art. And any of the sort of musicians that I've known whose music doesn't make sense until you've actually seen it live. Um, because a lot of music focus tends to be on stuff that's radio or dance floor or production line friendly. And uh, that sort of stuff works really badly live, generally. It can be quite boring. In order to survive, I, I, I need a cosmopolitan atmosphere. I, I, I have a sort of fascination for, I guess, ethnicity and life experiences and things like that. So I need to be surrounded by that diversity, as, as well as uh, high standards in music. I, I'd have to say we, we loved working with very, very good bands like Radiohead and the Lars and Pulp, we, you know, you know, they became almost like friends um, over the years. That was lovely working with the Kaiser Chiefs not so long ago. All the stuff we've had from New York, we've had a very close relationship with New York over the years. Um, Jimmy Dawson, Jeffrey Lewis, uh, Hamill, Curtis Seller, Seth. I think I'd just be part of a landscape. Yeah, you know, I've had over 30 years of uh, <coughs> being surrounded by people trying to take a piece out of me, and I love that. Uh, if, if I wasn't in the position I am at the Adelphi, I think I'd just disappear and be a part of a landscape. Lots of stuff that we can't tell you about, mind your business. <laughs>